Health officials taking a stand as COVID cases surge in the classroom. The Cobb County Board of Health just wrapping up a meeting. Go to CBS 46's Tori Cooper. She's live in Cobb County and Tori, many parents they want more measures in place, but it doesn't look like this is going to happen. That's right, Sean. As it stands right now, masks will remain optional in the Cobb County School District, but the Cobb County Board of Health made it very clear tonight that they do not support the Cobb County School District's current COVID-19 policy that does not include a mask mandate. They made it very clear that they want the district to follow all of the CDC guidelines, which include making testing more available, as well as making sure that students and staff are vaccinated who are eligible. Chairwoman Lisa Cupid and other leaders wanted to call this meeting to make their position well known to the community on this issue in hopes that the Cobb County School District would make a new decision to issue a mask mandate for students K through 12. They highlighted the alarming data in the district as well as the county, but the superintendent Chris Rags Ragsdale was not ready to vote on any new mask guidelines for K through 12. He believes that the multi layered approach is best, but the board was very clear tonight. This current guidance from both national health agencies notes that all policy considerations for school plans should start with the goal of keeping students safe and physically present in school. Number two, all eligible individuals should receive the COVID-19 vaccination. All, number three, all students older than two years of age and all school staff should wear face masks at school unless medical or developmental conditions prohibit the use. Yeah, that call to action very clear tonight. The board reiterated that they are hoping that this will not be a permanent solution or an adjustment, but minor just something temporary while we can get the numbers down here in Cobb County. Meanwhile, the superintendent was not sold on the idea. The way that he concluded this meeting was he said that he needed to go back and look at the statement so that he can make a clear decision on what's next. But as of right now, masks will remain as a recommended option. Reporting live in Cobb County, I'm Tori Cooper, CBS 46 News. Tori, thank you.